You're so cute. Hi, buddy. Oh my goodness. So I rescued a rabbit from a hoarding case. Literally Easter morning, I came out to check on her and she had given birth to 14 baby bunnies. So many bunnies. And they were so tiny, they were naked. I need Tim, hello my friend. Tim was the smallest by far. Let's see if he held on to his weight from yesterday. He was 1.15. Oh, <gasps> he just fell. But like very feisty. You could always see him in the middle of the pile trying to get warm. He was super scrawny. He had bald spots. He just looked very disheveled, like he'd had a rough night. <laughs> I need Tim, your eyes are opening, little one. Does look like a mouse. Oh, Tim, you're so small compared to everybody else. I took him to the vet to get his skin checked. They didn't know what was wrong with him or why he looked so different. He uh, was such a voracious eater, so that was very encouraging. He would do this like little happy dance with his feet every time I would feed him. <laughs> Look at those feetsies. He slowly but surely started growing fluffier and fluffier, and he actually started to look like a real rabbit. Hi, Tiny Tim. Tim. One evening, I went to pack on the bunnies and Tim was stiff, cold. I was completely distraught. I think he's, I think he's fighting. I think he's breathe. fighting. Because his body's so cold. So cold. Shutting down. My heart was just broken. That's right. We're going to warm you up. And I'm just going to keep talking to you so you stay with us. Okay? He heard my voice and his little ears twitched and he was like, He parked up. I'm here, Mom. I'm here. I'm back. I'm back. And he really hasn't left my side. Tim started following me around the house and coming whenever I called him. Come on! Oh, good boy! I didn't know, I didn't realize like how special that bond could be. He just brings like so much joy to my life and like seek you out for love. There was just no way that he was gonna go with anyone else. I need Tim. So freaking cute. Our house is very chaotic. There are lots of animals and the fact that Tim fits in with everyone is huge. Our most recent foster puppies were actually about the same exact size as Tim. So they loved cuddling together. Oh my gosh. Tim will constantly <laughs> start doing zoomies, basically just expressing pure joy to be alive. The real kicker, you don't actually know a rabbit sex until about eight weeks old, and it turns out that Tim's a girl! <laughs> she's the biggest love, she's so curious, she loves everyone, and she's just full of joy. She's just happy to be here. <laughs> she's so awesome.